guys, it's Shumi and welcome back to another video. So today we are doing like a modern type suburban house. It looks traditional from the outside, but I tried to make the inside as modern as I could. Um, this is kind of because some of you guys had asked if I could do more family houses and I know you guys like my actual like house speed builds and also you wanted modern houses, which I don't really like, but you know, I, I, I'll do it for you guys. Um, so today I thought I would just address something, streaming. <laughs> um, if you, I'm not sure when I'm putting this up during the week, I haven't decided yet. Um, but if you noticed at the weekend, I did a cheeky little stream. Now, I'm not promising that these streams will become a weekly thing. I can't promise that. I can't promise how much homework I'm going to have. So that might not happen every week, but it was really fun actually. Um, thank you if you came. I know it was a little weird time of day for you guys. Um, I would like to know if you could let me know in the comments what time of day you normally watch your streams because depending on where you are in the world, I don't know, like, I think a lot, the majority of the people who watch my videos are either from Europe or you're from the United States or, like, North America. So, um, you guys are, like, at most eight hours behind me, so it's kind of hard to work out a time that would be good because I've got, like, stuff in the evenings and I can't really stream in the evenings, but mornings are easier for me, but then it's, like, one o'clock in the morning where you are, so... <laughs> It's stressful, but it's fine. We'll work through it. I'm glad you enjoyed the stream. Um, I hope it wasn't too laggy. Um, I need to stop saying um. <laughs> yeah, that, so that was fun. It was a nice twist. Um, I was I watched a video on how to stream using OBS, which is the recording software I use. So it was a lot easier for me to um. I I don't know. There weren't there wasn't that many people in my house, so I was so people weren't complaining about me like taking up all of the internet and just annoying people and that's all not an issue anymore um but also I thought I'd just address this house for a little bit I guess this is kind of inspired by I watch a lot of youtubers I I don't know I sometimes get into like watching mum youtubers or like mom I don't know, that's fine that sounds so weird to me but like youtubers that just like vlog with their kids and stuff or people that like do homeware hauls I don't know this seems to me like there was a family who bought this kind of like traditional house and then they did it up to be like really like Instagram worthy on the inside. It's not that Instagram worthy. Like this is not my finest. But as I said, I can't do modern houses. We've been over this. It's just a whole thing. <laughs> so funnily enough, whilst I was recording this, this is a small story. Um, I had to go downstairs because my dogs were fighting, and I was like, "Why are my dogs fighting? This makes absolutely no sense." Well, they. I mean, they like they fight, but only in the way that dogs do. Like they don't. I don't know, it's kind of hard to explain. If you want to know what my dogs look like, go follow my Instagram. I posted a photo of my dogs on there. Speaking of which, hang on, that I'll get back to the dog story in a second, but this just leads me on to my um, spontaneous Instagram shout out. Oh my god, right, okay, hang on. Shroomy Sims on Instagram. Oh, 56 followers, nearly at 60 followers, guys. That's cool. Um, right, spontaneous, who's followed me recently? Emily EXT and Wizbiz. Cool. There you go. Those are my spontaneous Instagram shout outs. <laughs> um, yeah, so back to the dog story. So I was up here recording this video. I can't remember whether it was this video or the video that's going up the, the other one this week. <laughs> I've done a room build. But I went downstairs and I was like, what is happening with my dogs? Like, what what's happening? You know when you just look at your dogs and I'm like, what exactly happened here? You know what happened here. I don't. And then my dogs kind of just give me this like guilty look. <laughs> um, but anyway, it turns out there was a wooden spoon on the floor in my kitchen. <laughs> and I don't know where they'd got this wooden spoon from, but we bought this wooden, <laughs> just a short history of my wooden spoon. So we bought this wooden spoon when we were on holiday in France because we forgot a spoon and it, w it was a whole thing. But anyway, this spoon was like a stupidly long. <laughs> Do you think about the length of a normal spoon, like a normal cooking spoon? It was that, plus another handle's worth. <laughs> so I mean, I can't really blame the dogs for wanting to eat it. It did look a lot like a stick. But I came downstairs and there was just like half of this spoon <laughs> was in one half of the room and then the other half was like on the floor. And they were just giving me this really guilty look. It's not like they just chewed the handle, they chewed the spoon bit as well. So that that happened it was quite funny to be honest um but yeah it's i i don't know my dogs annoy me all the time but 
that's fine. Um, thank you for getting me to 10,000 views. This is the first time I've been able to address it in a speed build because of the way I record my videos. Yeah, cool. <laughs> thank you so much for getting me to 10,000 subscri 10, subscribers. Jeez, we're not there yet. <laughs> um, but yes, I would really like to grow our channel. So if any of you guys want to like just, I don't know, help me get, not, and like, I don't know, because if you, any of you guys have a YouTube channel, you know how hard it is if you're not a popular YouTuber, people don't see your videos and then you don't grow because your channel doesn't get as much exposure because everyone's feeds are flooded with massive YouTubers. I don't know, it's, it's a hard thing to explain unless you've been through it, but yeah, I would like to grow it a bit more, but it's fine. I mean, we've been stuck on the same amount for a while now, and I really want to get to a thousand. I feel like that's a crazy amount of people. I would love to get there, um, because I think I'm planning on doing a sim self for a thousand, which, I mean, if that's any motivation at all, <laughs> you can get me to... Why, well, you guys can't. Don't go and make, like, 10 million accounts. <laughs> but I don't know, I just want, I want to grow my channel. Um, I'm planning to collab with some YouTubers, but that's kind of like falling through because I don't have Twitter, so I can't message them and it's just, it's stressful. But if you have anyone you'd want me to collab with, like realistically guys, <laughs> um, don't pick someone like really far out. But yeah, if you want to, if you want me to collab with anyone in particular, just say something or if anyone's watching this and they want to collab, cool, hit me up. <laughs> Um, yeah, I just thought I'd talk about for a moment podcasts because I know this is like a, oh my god, it's another sim YouTuber like talking about how much they like podcasts, like meh. Um, but and seriously, if you don't get into podcasts, who are you? I don't think we can be friends. <laughs> um, I just thought I'd take you like a little run through of my favourite podcasts. Um, I listen to Dear Hank and John, obviously, like it's a really good podcast. Um, I got into it because of Lil Simsy and I'm not turning back, it's a great podcast. I also listen to her podcast, obviously. It's really good. Um, also, I have two others that you might not have heard of. So I listen to Ladies Who Lunch, which is by Ingrid Nielsen, who is like a beauty YouTuber. And, and it's her, with her friend Kat. And that is a really good podcast, especially if you've got like an issue with a specific thing. Like listening to that, it kind of like opens your mind about it. It's more of an advice -y type one. Um, and then I also listen to one that I'm pretty sure you haven't heard of, which is called No Such Thing as a Fish. Um, I might link it, I can't remember if I'm gonna link it or not, but it's run by the people who work at QI. If you're not from the UK, QI is a TV program where like they just talk about like facts they found out basically. It sounds boring, it's actually quite funny. Um, I watch it a lot because my family like it, but this podcast is just run by people who work there and it's really funny actually they just kind of talk about just stuff they found out and they go into more depth about it it's really funny um i'm actually going to go and see a live recording of it soon which ah that sounds really fun um yeah i'm kind of just freaking out about it i thought i'd address this again i probably should address this at the start i always remember stuff that i meant to say and then i forget to mention it and ugh. anyway left a bit too late now but i thought i'd address pets now someone asked me if I wanted if I was gonna do a review on the cats and dogs cats and dogs expansion. <laughs> Ooh. Um which I would absolutely love to do a review on the cats and dogs expansion. But um I normally get my Sims expansion packs for Christmas because if you've noticed the Sims release their expansion packs around November every year and I can't <laughs> If you think about it, I, I don't have a job. Well, I guess YouTube is my job now. Hey, <laughs> 10,000 10, views. Um, but not enough of a job to pay £40 for an expansion pack as soon as it comes out. Also, I like to wait for the hype to settle down a little bit. Obviously, that really isn't going to apply. Like, uh, the hype is not going to affect my opinion um, because I really want pets. <laughs> but um, it's always kind of hard for me that, like, month until I get... I get it but I don't know if you guys would still want me to do a review on it when I get it in in December um because obviously it will have gone down then and may, many of you guys might have already got it so I don't know if you would still like me to do a review on it I'm I will happily do a review on it I am planning on doing Christmas videos um but I don't want to like make it too festive I don't know I'll do like wintery videos I don't want to make it too festive in case some of you guys don't celebrate Christmas and I don't want to be like shoving Christmas down your throats um so if you guys want to see that I'm excited for Christmas videos I like Christmas but I pr much prefer autumn which it's starting to get in the UK it's starting to get really cold and like rainy and I'm like yes 
I just, it's something about it raining. I just like being cold. I'm trying to speak slower in this video. Don't think I'm doing a very great job. Also, hello if you are someone who puts me on in the background. I do that with speed builds. I just kind of listen to them like a podcast. So this, if you're listening to me in the background, get back to doing your work or whatever you're doing. <laughs> I listened to, um, well actually I stopped listening to um, Speedball whilst I was doing my homework. I kind of have my phone turned off whilst I'm doing it because I listen to Spotify. Would you like to know what I'm listening to on Spotify at the moment? I really like the All Good playlist which has a broccoli on it <laughs> um, and the Stress Buster is like a playlist of songs you have never heard of but they're all like background music because I find that if I listen to uh songs that I've like I know all the words to and are really catchy whilst I'm doing my homework I get really distracted and start singing um and that's not good for homework where I like need to concentrate but if it's homework where I'm a bit like meh it's not as important <laughs> all homework's important kids do your homework um but if it's if I find it's homework that isn't as important I like to listen to kind of fun music but yes um yeah, that's kind of an update. I have to record another voiceover, so I don't know what I'm going to say. Um, but that is fine. Um, again, I say I say this in every voiceover, but I just want to make sure. I hope all of you guys are okay with all, like, hurricanes and stuff. Um, which is kind of terrifying. But it's fine. We're, we'll cope. <laughs> that sounds really bad. Um, yeah, also, just comment any video ideas. Because I have to film these at the weekend. I want to make stuff that you guys want to in you guys want to watch basically and I'm not going to spend ages making a video that you won't enjoy so yes that is kind of what, what I'm trying to say but it's a very long-winded way of saying it um if you've enjoyed this video please like comment and subscribe to be part of the shroomy family we've been through this before um bye guys